the perfect solution for you. This is called Thermafreeze, and we have Lisa Brady here to tell us all about it and give us a guided tour. Welcome back. Nice, nice to see you. Great to be here. This is such a cool item, it is, pun it? intended. Yes, there you go. Because this is all about using some really interesting technology mm -hmm. right. that will turn your cooler nice and cold, but won't turn it into a soppy, melty, watery mess. Exactly. And on that note, let me show you how it works. Because Let's do this it. thermofreeze is the perfect alternative to ice and gel packs. Okay. This is what we have. We use the ice. And what does it do? It melts and it makes a big, wet, drippy mess, okay? So you don't want to have to deal with that. Or you use the big, bulky gel packs over here. Now, these, of course, They take up so much room in the cooler, you can't get anything exactly. inside. And they're heavy, David, and they don't conform around your food and beverages to keep them cold. We have the solution. Thermo freeze. Flexible when frozen, okay, so you don't have to worry about that not conforming. And look at this. You can cut it to size. It fits exactly anywhere you need it. All you have to do is freeze it, and you're good to go. And what it doesn't do is mm -hmm. melt and turn your cooler into a swimming pool right. down below. Everything doesn't go swimming in the water and all that icy mess. Exactly. This exactly. is $17.41. Let's, uh, oh, you want to take but a quick look there? I just want to show you sure. the thermometers. So this, to me, is everyone should do their own test to get it. Here we have two thermometers, David. There's everything identical in the cooler. I put two containers of milk in each one, and I put a thermometer in each one of the coolers. As you'll notice, it was set two hours and 55 minutes ago. The temperature in the thermofreeze of the milk is 37 degrees. The temperature in the gel pack cooler for the milk is 48 degrees. And what we did is we put the probe down in the milk container, exactly. so we would know exactly what the internal temperature was of each right. milk container. Yep. The gel pack cooler... 48 degrees. Mm -hmm. The thermofreeze, how much? 37. 37. Let's come up here and show That's everybody right. what they have, what they'll get, and okay. what they can choose from. Okay. We have two wonderful patterns. We have plaid and mm -hmm. we also have polka dots. Right. So we're going to hook you up there. Here are your polka dots, here are your, your plaids, plaids right. and then how many of each you do we get? You get a total of 15 sheets in each pack. Mm -hmm. So when, whichever one you choose, you get 15 sheets. You get 10 of the um, medium sheets and you get 5 of the large sheets. And this is the medium size, this is the large size. And here's how it's going to work. You're going to mm -hmm. take this and actually submerge it in cool water. Is in, that in right? In warm water. I put or it in warm, warm water. water. Or you can run it under the tap. Either way. But this is how you get it at home. So it's nice and small to com and compact so that mm -hmm. if you're traveling, you want to bring it on vacation, you don't have to worry about freezing it ahead of time. So this is how you get it. There's a non-toxic polymer gel inside. And you, if you can see, there's individual cells. So you can actually cut that to any size you want. Put it in the warm water. Within a minute or so, it's going to puff up like this. Right. And, it, and then you pat it dry, put it in your freezer, and in less than two hours, David, you have got a rock hard solid frozen thermostat. Now here's a here's a question for you. Once mm -hmm. it thaws out, uh, do I have to throw it away or can I use it again? No, 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 no. Pat it dry, put it back in the freezer, reusable, no problem. Awesome. Yep. Now you're going to get 15 of these sheets. They can be cut and become customizable. You can wrap things up because they're flexible. These are a really smart idea. And mm -hmm. if this week is any indication of the summer we have in front of us, I know. it's going to be a beastly hot summer. Yep. You need to be able to do everything you can do to beat the heat and stay ahead of all that problem and in that heat. Look at here, what we've done with okay. our lunch tote. So a lot of us are trying to, we all, a, lot, a lot of people on the Saatchi bag and they're bringing that to work with them, but how do you keep things cold in there? So here I've cut this to size to fit it on top. I have wrapped individually my water bottle. Okay. I have my yogurt. It literally wraps all the way around it. I love that. And then I put one in the bottom, put my sandwich, my fruit in. I don't want to wrap my sandwich or my fruit, but it's going to stay cold while it's in here. And then you don't have to worry. Like, can you imagine, David, trying to fit this in here? You might as well take out your yogurt and your and your fruit because you're going to be only eating a sandwich and drinking your water. It's absolutely <laughs> true. But let's think about this: how you'll use it in and around your home, outside for mm -hmm. entertaining. You want to put a bottle of wine on ice out on the picnic table. Right. You put it out in ice, and it quickly turns into a big bucket of water. It does. You put it out in your thermofreeze. It keeps your white wine frosty cold. Exactly. But what we haven't done is we haven't made it so wet that the label then peels away right. because it's so wet. Not only that, look, David. When you take this out, like let's say you've got oh, oh, oh so look, look at mess. that big mess that I just made all over my placemat because it's sitting in wet water. Need water. to let you know of our two choices, plaid mm -hmm. is the most limited. So if oh, you want the plaid, okay. uh, Lisa and I had this on in the kitchen with David about a week ago, didn't yes, we? Yes. And it just flew oh, out the door. Oh, and so oh. plaid is now limited. This is, I think, only a second time back on the air. Is that yeah, right? Second time. So definitely grab yours now. Let's go to our phones welcoming Diana in Wisconsin. Diana, how's the, uh, how's the weather today? How warm is it where you are? 90 plus. Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> now, up in Wisconsin, you 
all are not necessarily used to those kinds of temperatures, are you? No, we are not, but we went to the beach today, and I could have used this product. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry. How will you use this when you get it? Well, we go to the beach almost every day. My husband retires this Friday, so that's where we plan on spending a lot of our time. Congratulations. Wonderful. So wow. we're going to put it around our items. What I like is... A, the size of it, mm -hmm. it won't be as heavy as the ice pack exactly. or the ice. Yep. It's not going to make a big mess, so we'll be able to keep our sandwiches cold, our your drinks. I think it's just going to be super, and I love the patterns. I know, it's they're <laughs> fun. Now, did you go for plaid or the polka dots? I went for the plaid. Nice. Ah. Well, I'm glad you did. That one's the most limited, and already now almost 800 of these have been ordered. Diana, I think you'll love this, and the best part is, Diana, you can use this over and over mm -hmm. and over again. You're never going to have to worry about running, stopping by the convenience store or the grocery store to bag a, buy a bag of ice. Well, that sounds super to me, and David, we just love watching you, my husband and I both. Well, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. I hope you'll tune back in tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We're going to bring you the p.m. edition of In the Kitchen with David. And tonight we're to continuing our Italian summer cooking theme. We're making grilled pepper and sausage sandwiches tonight. Oh, yummy. We will be there. <laughs> Sounds good. Thank you, Diana. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Diana. Now, think about this. You're packing things for uh, the babies and whatnot. Mm -hmm. you know, maybe baby formula or what have you. Come right. join me right over here, my darling. Okay. Because we've got an update for you. Okay. If you want the plaid, you need to be on the phone line because this is last call in the plaid. The plaid is almost gone. We have a bit more of the polka dot to go around, but they okay. both work exactly the same. Yep. And if the pattern doesn't matter to you, go ahead and order whatever you like. But if you want the plaid, you need to be on the line now because it's last call in the plaid. Right. I love that. Great. And so, uh, 15 sheets total, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. So, and again, we're just going to show you different ways of, of wrapping it around. I put one in the baby bottle here. We can use it to wrap even around big, huge, I love that. Even bottle. around a two-liter soda yeah. bottle. And now everything stays frosty cold. We're almost out of time. I need to let you know over 1,500 are gone. Wow. I'm not surprised. We're very busy on the phone lines. Last call on that plaid. Mm -hmm. And let's face it, it's a hot, hot summer already. Now's the time. Miss Lisa, thank, thank you. Thank you, and plan has sold out. Oh, okay. okay so plan is gone. Only polka dot remains. That's K34711. We're still.